Oh, this is this is a disaster right before it even starts. What's going on, my little piglets? It's your BFF Fortchop here, and I'm coming at you with another food review. But it's a food review with a twist. I decided to create my own creation. Create my own creation. Yeah, that sounds about right. I did the McLand Aaron C from McDonald's. Something that a couple of piglets and I formed together. Because I said, you tried this at McDonald's. Now go to Burger King and get it figured out. So I got it figured out. So I decided to go to Burger King and try the King's land air and sea so what i did was is i got a big fish a double cheeseburger and a crispy chicken sandwich junior they're going to be totally different sizes i'm calling it right now i thought i was going to make out like a bandit because this is actually cheaper than the mcland air and sea the double cheeseburger is a dollar 69 i was like okay i can do that a crispy chicken junior is a dollar straight up and a big fish is $3.79, so yay. <laughs> okay, so the, the burger and the chicken are the same size. So that's not too bad. It's this I'm worried about. Because this thing is probably going to be huge. I don't want to have pickles on it too. Awesome. You know, how about I just wipe some of that tartar off of it? There we go. Oh, God, no. That landed on the floor. Oh, God, no. Oh, this is this is a disaster right before it even starts. The King's Land Air and Sea. There, there you go. You're gonna get a perception. Burger, chicken, fish. The fish I, I called it is way bigger than the other two. And I'm already getting ketchup and mayo and tartar sauce everywhere. Okay, so that looks like a good portion right there, so let's go. Mmm. I'm disgusted with myself, but not bad. Just the inside of that, it's a monstrosity. And this is something the king is keeping down in the dungeon so nobody knows about it. The only thing though, that I can taste though, is once again, one flavor is overpowering the other, just like the Mickland Aaron see. And that is the chicken is getting like zero recognition. The beef is barely there. And then the fish, because it's so big, I believe, is just overpowering everybody else let's give this another bite now you see i tasted the chicken on that one because i said something that's how that works i actually think i like this a lot more than mcdonald's land air and sea one more bite of this weird monstrosity so each bite i took i tasted the flavors differently first one all i could taste was the fish second one all i could taste was the chicken third one taste of that burger. So one thing I like about it, one thing I don't like about it. One thing I like about it is, surprisingly, this is very good. It is fantastic. The, the protein packed sandwich, there you go. So one thing I did like about it though is some assembly required because you have to build this yourself. Burger King's gonna look at you and say, what the hell are you asking for? We don't even know what that is. I bet some weird guy down in Texas built this. You're gonna have to build it yourself and it is messy. Like I am getting stuff everywhere, all over me, all over my car. Have you tried this for some miraculous reason? Let me know what your rating is. Because on a scale of one to 10 piglets, I'm gonna have to give this bad boy, because it's my own baby. I'm gonna have to give this a 10 out of 10 pork chops kick ass silver approval because I made this. I made this. I'm pretty sure that God's up there right now saying, everybody's a kick ass silver approval because I made y'all. So, guys, give this a try. Tell me what you think. Due to YouTube's new format, I'm gonna put the subscribe button right here and then I'm gonna put a video right here for you guys to watch. So, guys, thank y'all so much once again for dropping by. Always leave me your recommendations and then you might get a shout out in the next video. And as always, my little pig, let's call him Pork Chop, loves y'all the most. So y'all take it easy, guys, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye, guys!